Who's to blame for the blackface, brownface, or is it Justin Trudeau himself or white privilege in general? Does he still have the moral authority in which to govern? Absolutely. David Menzies in the Toronto riding of Scarborough Rouge Park. I'm at the Malvern Recreation Centre and uh, I'm waiting for a debate to begin with the candidates here. Uh, it was supposed to have kicked off about half an hour ago. The Liberal MP for the riding, Gary Ananda Sangari, has yet to arrive. But although I think I did see him pull into a parking space a few seconds ago. In any event, uh, irony alert, the topics du jour here tonight are racial justice and youth issues. Hmm, race and youth. Why does that ring a bell? Oh yeah, that's right. When our prime minister was younger, uh, he really played the race card big time by slapping his face with brown face and black face on numerous occasions. And you know, further irony is that the incumbent MP, Gary, is a visible minority himself. I wonder how he feels about his boss doing that, especially a prime minister who says he's all about diversity and inclusion and minority rights, yet seemingly goes out of his way to mock um, minorities whenever the case presents itself. In any event, I'm going to wait here, I'll wait for Gary's arrival, and see if he'll answer some of these questions about his commander in chief. Oh, hi there, Gary. David Menzies with Rebel News. Just wondering, will you condemn Justin Trudeau's use of blackface and brownface? Sir, as a person who's a visible minority yourself, how did it make you feel seeing those pictures? I don't give interviews to Rebel Media. Oh, is that right? Why is that, sir? That's fine. That's my choice. Okay. Uh, who's... Nice shoulder block. <laughs> oh, sorry, um, who's to blame for the blackface, brownface, sir? Is it Justin Trudeau himself or white privilege in general? Does he still have the moral authority in which to govern? Absolutely. Well, there you have it, folks. Um, not many answers at all. In fact, the silent treatment, uh, the only question he did answer was that Justin Trudeau indeed has the moral authority in which to govern still after all these scandals. You know, it's funny, all these liberals, um, they remind me of uh, the old TV series, Hogan's Heroes, particularly one character, Sergeant Schultz. You know, I know nothing, I saw nothing. They all take the silent treatment when it comes to talking about the odious actions of Justin Trudeau. Even those liberal MPs who are visible minorities themselves. I guess that's what's called taking one for the team. But personally, I don't know how they live with themselves. For the Rebel News, I'm David the Menzoid Menzies. Hey folks, if you liked that video, please press like and subscribe and never miss another Rebel News video.